Top Yards appeared to hold all the aces in Saturday's 2 million Rand Grade 1 Sansui Summer Cup and trainer Jeff Woodruff goes for his third successive victory in Gauteng's flagship feature. But he will have to thwart a serious challenge from some of his big name colleagues. A capacity field of 20 will line up shortly after 4pm on Saturday for a handicap that is capable of throwing up a curved ball or two. Firstly, there's the Michael de Kock stable. They have won this race no fewer than 10 times. And of course, there's Sean Terry, who has the favorite, a horse called French Navy, who was the champion Equus three-year-old winning two grade one races worth two million rand during the course of the last season. He was very unlucky in this year's Vodacom Durban July, suffering severe interference. And he looks set on the long run in at Turfentain to make atonement for his performance at Gravel. Then there's the Dean Canamea trained Power King who was the victor of this year's Vodacom Durban July and he's drawn well at five. He hails from KwaZulu-Natal and raids from Sommerfeld, which has been the case for the past few seasons for the Canamea stable. The powerful Cape-based stable of Joe Ramsden has sent two runners to Gauteng for the past eight weeks. They have been stabled in the Michael de Kock yard and they are represented by Disco L and the very progressive San Tropez who was victorious in his only start here in Gauteng. Former champion trainer Justin Snaith saddles two runners, one in Ultimate Dollar and the other one in Dynamic. Ultimate Dollar was far from disgraced in his first start in Gauteng when running third over 1,450 meters on the sand. The second run off the layoff syndrome could be blamed for his somewhat lackluster performance in the charity mile, but he's being ridden by Pierre Stratum, last year's winner, and he is set to turn the corner and deliver a five-star performance, albeit draw 19. This is the Sansui Summer Cup, Africa's richest handicap over 2,000 meters and certainly the most exciting, heritage-filled handicap on the high field.